important you guys to know about me is that I can absolutely not stand these guys. I don't like the taste of bananas, I don't like the texture, I hate the smell, so this is a bit of a struggle for me. So I'm gonna do what I usually do, not use a recipe, pray that it works, and see how we go. So my family will be tasting it for me today, so they will be brutally honest. So I hope you like what I'm going to cook, and I hope they like what I'm going to cook. But at least if I poison them, you guys will be fine. Let's get started. I didn't say what I was cooking. So today I'll be cooking some banana dumplings with a nice cashew caramel. I don't eat dairy, so I'm trying to do like a healthy vegan attempt at a caramel. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I have high hopes. If not, I'm sure it'll still taste nice just a spoon straight into the mouth anyway, without the dumpling situation. crisp. Really Is it good? Really? products. I'm really happy with how they turned out. They're really crispy and crunchy and the gooey center just like oozes out because it's nice and hot. Uh, we do serve it up with ice cream but unfortunately the ice cream rolled off the plate so we decided to picture that maybe we wouldn't include that. And we have a lovely caramel uh, cashew butter as just like a little ooey gooey base. Which is just an extra bit of caramel because who doesn't like caramel? This is one that I've done without banana. The cinnamon sugar is so good too. Yeah, she's so crispy and I've got it all over my face. Would recommend, definitely. <laughs> 